might have been super turrican. I'm not sure. Look at this fella. Never got a chance to play this. Hell yeah, Murik. Uh, it's never too late. Super Turok can? <laughs> Super Turok can. Two words. Super Turok can. Hey, Murik. How are you doing today? It's good to see you as always. It's boss time. Uh, I probably should have healed. That's okay. How are you doing, Murik? How's the full quiet routing going? Shoutouts out there. Everyone check out Murik. They're doing a uh, routing for speedrunning of full quiet, which is the newly developed NES game. Everyone check out Magashi-sama. We do random indie games. And uh, Robert Douglas is in here earlier. I came out, he plays a lot of Doom mods and other things. Well, under half my halfway at the moment, it's a hard run, I'm sure it is. A lot of places to lose time, I'm sure. Critical hit. Wow. We gotta change colors. Poisonous bile. Well, that is just disgusting. That is the worst. Maybe we don't want to save our friends that badly. Try a couple of different colors, see what they do. That's 173 for red. 34 for, so it's definitely not purple. I think red and green are the best so far. Uh, blue is the best. Yeah, it's just it's higher level. Reds are overrated. It's true. Don't save them, yeah. One of them happens to be our father, too, but that's okay. Give me strength. I'm 26. Really not that much more than attacking. Actually, less than attacking. Yeah. Give me strength. Attacking is better than magic in this situation, I think. Poison is vile. Poison is wrecking me. Good items.
Weird dissonant synth screams in the music track are very fun, yes. Okay, yeah, that gets rid of the poison. This should work. Frost breath. Got frost breath and venomous bile. It's not the way to go. Let's try this. Let's try this. This should work. Ba -ba -ba. Special move. That's decent. Let's try this. I'm gonna stay alive. This should work. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ah, you missed. Do that again, that was good. Attack! I like the music change, it's so fun. Great transition, yeah, and it also transitions to like a desperate theme if you get low on health. So it like goes back and forth. It's pretty cool. Makes you feel like a movie. Counter, nice. Took a poison from doing a counterattack. Or maybe probably got poisoned for the initial hit. Finish this. Wrong element. Oh, you missed.
Yeah, she just doesn't do a lot of physical attack. That's fine. Better our magic. He keeps missing. Yeah, that definitely hurts less with the Delta Shield. Stupid old man, miss. No death perception. That's true. Epic final hit. Oh, that's cool. And the town is destroyed. And we've defeated the last manatee. Save. Ba -da -da. real quick. Speed. Ooh, max HP. Yeah, let's throw it on Vice. Diamantes eat human fathers too. <laughs> eat human fathers though. Probably best that they are extinct now. Yes. True conservation. All those dead dads. Looks like this ladder leads straight up into the Coliseum. Yeah, let's go. Hotel Echo. And now we present the executions of the notorious air pirate Dine and his treacherous band of blue robes. Their crimes include attacking Imperial airships and stealing precious cargo. The price of stealing from Valoa is high. Dine and his pitiful band will pay with their heads. Looks like we gave up after all. I knew it. Huh? Nice. <laughs> Hurry, run for the opening of the floor. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I miss you guys. We're here to rescue you. Come on, let's go. First person rush, yeah. Well, how very bold of you. You have deprived the audience from witnessing the deaths of a notorious band of air pirates. Now they will witness your execution. I don't know why you're all upset. The audience already got to watch us free for free our friends and trash your guards. Now they get to watch us beat the snot out of you. What more could they want? By the way, the name's Vice. Boss fight. I 
get the little guys first. Uh, spell wardens, yeah. the best? Vistali! guy's definitely dead. That was very efficient. Incrum. An attack buff. Looks like it. Yeah. Uh oh. Ow! I don't even know that I have a way to revive. You can play at that game. Heal up. That's better. Take this. Cool. Oh no. <laughs> Jesus. All right, it's up to you, Drachma. It'd be cool to do something like this in a TTRPG and do consecutive boss fights like this. I love it story wise, I have a strong desire to do it, but it would, would it be cool to do as a DM? It just depends on how you do it. Because if you're just like, if everyone's almost dead and then they don't get an opportunity to heal or like do any kind of long rest before the, the next fight, and like, well, did you want to do a total party wipe? <laughs> Yeah, it really matters on party resources and level for sure. Or like just how hard the encounters are. The players may need to stop being babies. Maybe. This should work. Yeah, for sure. 
Yeah, party composition is a big deal. Definitely not green, okay. Red's fine, but I think... I think he's a tank. It's all about balance, Green Lantern fan. You can do it in a way that's balanced. This should work. Yeah, he holds. Jeez. That move is brutal. I'm almost out of feels. This should work. I go back. Nice. Finished him off. <laughs> Piece of cake. Like <laughs> Barely got him down. <laughs> I need to get some revival things. Electric box and Sacrus Crystal Dice. Breaking real rough. Cool. Well, we made it through. What was that? Love an occasional subversion of the few. We're in the clear feeling. Personally, I feel like if the boss is clearly foreshadowed and people have several opportunities to notice the threat, pair turn back, etc. Anything is game. Couple games are fun because anything can happen. Yes, exactly. And sometimes it's fun when a character gets the opportunity to like sacrifice themselves for the party. Gandalf or something like that. Or, Run, you fools! Hey, you really did it! You rescued your friends! I can't believe it! You really are something! Marco, what are you doing here? I told you before, right? I live here. I know everything about these sewers. This wall was built with a secret door. I took your friends into the secret room just behind me. Oh, cool. Did it. Yeah, the Gandalf feeling. <laughs> a little late, Vice. For any later, it'd be a whole head shorter right now. 
Vice, I always knew you were tough. Breaking into a public execution and freeing all of us. Now I think you're crazy, too. <laughs> what can I say? I'm not ready to take over as head of the Dine family just yet. Wait a minute, where's Fina? Fina? When they captured us from Pirate Isle, they took her somewhere else. I overheard some soldiers talking about her. It sounded like she was taken to the Valuan Imperial Palace. <gasps> what? Why was she taken to the palace? It appears that the Empress herself wanted to meet Fina. I've got a feeling that there's more to that girl than meets the eye. She knows something important enough to have value after her. Fina! Vice, what are you going to do? We should lay low for a little while. If we start combing the palace, we'll be spotted for sure. We've still got lots to learn. This is Valua. We'll be discovered sooner or later, whether or not we remain in hiding. Maybe our only chance to save Fina. Right now, the Imperial troops are more concerned about finding us. Here, take this with you, Vice. A little early to be giving this to you, but considering the circumstances, I'll make an exception. Wow, it's your yellow moonstone. Thanks, Dad. If you use it with your weapons, they'll take on the properties of lightning. I will take all of the air pirates back to the Little Jack. Be waiting for you. You need to be at Little Jack when they open the gates. Uh huh. I know. When the gates open, it's our only chance to escape. Huh. First, you'll want to go up to Upper City. You might be able to sneak around and board a rail car that's on its way to the palace. I see. Upper City, huh? Marco, how do I get to Upper City from here? Um, if you go down that tunnel over there, you'll reach Upper City. But there are tons of guards in Upper City. You shouldn't go. It's too dangerous. I'm ready for anything, Marco. In the midst of the storm, I can see one path that will get us out of Valua. I've got to try. Let's go, Aka. We've got to save Fina. Rakma has left the park. Receive the yellow moonstone from Dine. Hell yeah. Well, we can use yellow magic. <laughs> the way there is literally the only other way open to it. You're in magic, that's right. We are in the sewers after all. <laughs> Probably should have healed. Retreat! One HP. MP. I really need to stock up on items now. Hopefully I'll get an opportunity when I get to the upper city. Mm -hmm. Up the ladder we go. I thought that lantern was a spider. Anything over here? Bush. Honestly, I'm just gonna run. I feel a lot weaker without Drachma and no items. No need to grind in this game, as far as I can tell. I don't have any MP either. Yeah. Wait, Vice!
Marco, Marco, you followed us? What's wrong? Ice, don't go. Please. My... my mother and father were both killed by Valawan soldiers while they were trying to escape from this city. There's no way out. Trying to get through the Grand Fortress is impossible. No one has ever escaped from Valawa. You're just gonna... You're gonna die this time. I just know it. Your parents. Your parents. I'm sorry to hear that, Marco. But I have to go. I don't have a choice. Every time I hear the word impossible, it makes me want to prove everyone wrong. A long time ago, a handful of sailors took a small boat out into uncharted skies. They had no idea what they would find. Monsters, the maelstrom, the end of the world. It was because of those sailors challenged the unknown. New lands were discovered. That's deranged, Divine. If we challenge ourselves and never give up, our own horizons will broaden. In our hearts, in our minds. I need to push myself every day. I have to know what I can accomplish. I never give up, and so far, nothing has ever stopped me. Somehow, I am still alive. But, but, Vice, don't worry about me. I believe that we'll make it out. I will find a way. That's what's keeping me going. I'm going to prove that it's not impossible to escape. Impossible is just a word to let people feel good about themselves when they quit. You're an idiot. Vice, do you think I could ever be a sailor? If I could ever sail the skies of Arcadia? Legends? Heh, <laughs> of course. You've got what it takes. I'll be waiting for you. Out there. Thank you. Meanwhile, Lord Galson brings good news, Your Majesty. Indeed, I do, Your Highness. I am sure you will be pleased. As you have requested, my forces have captured a Sylvite. Oh, excellent work, Galcyon. You have yet to fail me. So, this is what a Sylvite looks like. Hmm, such a beautiful girl. The clothes are interesting. A nice specimen. Today, we haven't taken another step closer to our main objective. Soon the Valawan Empire shall rule the world. Come. You seem sad, young one. How do you not rejoice with us? You shall witness our finest hour. You have the knowledge that we seek. You can assist us. <laughs> All who oppose us shall fall. Their islands will be reduced to ash and dust. Anyone who stands in our way will be destroyed. And you, young one, shall help us. Mother, ruling the world by force is not something that I am sure I approve of. An empire that does not listen to the plight of its people is destined to fall. Enrique, you still have much to learn. You cannot walk the path of an emperor and concern yourself with the petty worries of the people. But mother... Now, now, Enrique, I'm building an empire for you. Since you shall inherit the throne when I pass on, you should pay more attention. Well then, young lady... I know that there are six moon crystals, and that they have been scattered all over the world. I also know that, the, that he who controls the moon crystals controls weapons of mass destruction. I believe your people refer to them as Gigas. 
and the Gigas are ours. We shall rule the world. Now, young lady, you will tell me where to find the moon crystals. I will die before I tell you. What did you say? You do not understand how powerful the Gigas really are. Hey, ghost girl. Good to see you. Work's going well. The Gigas were great weapons of destruction built by the old world. They are more powerful than you can imagine. I'm going to check out Ghost Girl. They play lots of random variety stuff, some horror games. As well as dating sims and farming sims and other things. Check them out. And that is precisely why Valois must obtain these weapons. <laughs> Since we are the most powerful empire, we should have full control over them. And once we have them, we shall rule the world. Vice is the least appropriate person to be giving an impressionable, emotionally unstable youth life coaching lessons. Vice is literally stormed a public execution only survived because of drachma. It's true. Literally drachma. <laughs> drachma carried that fight. No, humans must never control the moon crystals. Gygus ever again. Power hungry dictators like you are the reason that humans must never control them. You dare insult me, the Empress of the Great Valuan Empire, in my own palace! Kill her! Kill her! Kill the little wench! Off with her head! Mother! Mother, think about what you are saying! You cannot kill her! She's done nothing wrong! Are you saying that this girl is innocent, Enrique, even after she insulted me so? Kill her! Kill her now! Please, you must believe me. The power of the Gigas is not to be underestimated. Silence, wench. You shall pay for your insolence. Hug. Lord Galcian, I bring urgent urgent news. Someone has broken into the Colosseum and freed the blue rogues. Hmm? What? I am on my way. Take the girl to the ship and bring her to the Grand Fortress, immediately. Yes, Lord Galcian. Your Majesty, I request permission to deploy the Armada. I will take the girl with me and she will guide me to the Moon Crystals. <laughs> Very well, then. Use the power of the Armada and bring the crystals to me. Of course, Your Majesty. However, I have but one humble request. I would like to rescue the request that a new addition be made to the highest ranking officers. I would like to recommend my vice captain Ramirez for the position. <gasps> Do as you wish. In return, I want you to give me your word that you will bring me those crystals. Yes. As you wish, your majesty. majesty. You heard the admiral. Get up. Ramirez. Meanwhile, back in the sewers. Zoe Fan. Let's, let's save. Let's save when you can. No reason not to. Ba da da. Da, da, da. Oh, are you a nobleman? You'll have to excuse me, but which family are you from? Uh. The Dine family? Me? I'm one of the members of the Dine family. Hmm, the Dine family, you say? I don't seem to recall any noble families of such a name. Well, just looking at you, I can tell that you come from a noble military family. I shall try to remember that name. My mommy told me that people in Lower City rarely get to eat white bread. That's stupid. If they can't eat bread, why don't they just eat cake? Hehehe. 
This is as valuable as Upper City. Only those of wealthy stature or born of noble blood live here, of course. A much better life up here in Upper City than you think. There are so many plays, so many parties. I'm a very busy person. Ice, this is no time to just sit around and drink tea. Any time is a good time to sit around and drink tea. A bathtub in my house is made of gold, you know. Pure gold, of course. But something is still missing. I know, I'll have my toilet made of pure silver. Great. Ah, the rich. Wow. Vice, that huge vehicle over there must be the rail car. I think you're right, Aka. Looks like you can only ride on those rails. I guess it would be hard to steal. Let me get a closer look. Zoom in. Enhance. Fina! What are you talking about? I thought Fina was supposed to be at the palace. That's what I thought, but it looks like that rail car is going to the Grand Fortress. If she gets taken into the fortress, we'll never be able to get her out. We'll have to move now. Sounds like the engines are starting. We'll never get down there in time. Yep, there's the EDU list. Ice, what should we do? And if you'll look, Green Lantern fan, there's a redeem now to add weight to uh, one of the choices. We've got to jump on the roof. What? Isn't there a plan B? Come on, Aka. This should be too tough. <laughs> Slide whistle. And I could die. Mina should be at the front rail car. Let's go. Lord Galcian, we've just received a message from Central Station in Upper City. They spotted some air pirates snooping around the rail cars. Hmm? What? And the air pirates who escaped execution. Are they still free? Yes, Lord Galcian, my humblest apologies. It matters not. I'll summon the city guards and sweep all of the rail cars. We'll find them. That won't be necessary. We know where they are heading. They are going to try to rescue the girl. What's the status of the Grand Fortress gates? They're currently open, sire. They aren't scheduled to close for a while. Close the gates immediately. Place all the ships in the bay on full alert. Dispatch the Imperial Railcar immediately. I shall deal with these pirates myself. Yes, Lord Galcian. Oh my god! Welcome on in, Candy Marsh and Raiders. Hide your carrots, it's a Candy Marsh raid. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Everyone, check out Candy Marsh. Mario's missing, hell yeah. Welcome, welcome, everyone, check out Candy Marsh. Fantastic streamer, thanks. Congratulations on the 500, I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, we hit 500 follows a few nights ago. Because of that, we're doing an entertainment stream. Thank you, Arco. Thank you, Candy. Hey, how are y'all doing? How was the stream today? Uh, 
Hell yeah. Yeah, welcome on in everybody from Candy's stream. Thank you for coming on over in the raid. Uh, we do lots of retro stuff here. My name is Plunge. And uh, today we're doing Skies of Arcadia Legends, which is a classic JRPG from the GameCube. Ah, ah. That's right. Oh, and thank you for the subscription, Candy. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the nine months. Crazy. What a crazy nine months it has been. Yeah, this is a chill JRPG. Cult classic. What? The gift bomb. Oh my goodness. You don't have to do that, Candy, but thank you very much. Holy crap. Enjoy your subs, Arco Misto, Babylon Zul, Magashi Sama, Murig, and Raincloud. Thank you so much, Candy. I really appreciate it. Chingu ya. Always do stuff I don't have to. It's true. I appreciate it. Wait, what? Hey, you got a gift, Arco Misto. Enjoy it. <laughs> thank you so much, Candy. Wow, this bot. <laughs> Candy MVP, that's right. Candy is absolutely MVP. Of course, of course. Yeah, everyone check out Candy Marsh. Always fun to hang out in their streams. We play League of Legends and other random things like It Takes Two, stuff like that. I don't see no mod. <laughs> This time he adds, it takes two. You, you do play mostly League of Legends. <laughs> we are mostly just doing a chatting stream, it looked like last time though, today. Say I do art, how dare. <laughs> There he is. Oh, the cape's coming off. Who's that, Vice? There's something about this guy. I'm not sure what it is, but I don't think we can take him. Hmm. Yeah, and he looks really mad, too. Aika, here's the plan. Run. We have to get to Fina before he catches us. Yeah. Run. Oh, yeah, he's like coming. Oh lord, he coming. <laughs> Wonder if he's still coming towards us. No, that'd be funny. What did he last save? Uh, after the last, after the executioner fight. So there's literally been no fights since then, other than a few random encounters. We just ha don't have any items. We haven't had a chance to rest at our inn or anything. Just get in a fight with him if you want to see what happens. Oh, that's funny. He does he just like one shot you? Who are you? Hey Sorry we took so long, Fina. We're here to get you out. Insolent pests. You'll have to get past us first. Bring it on. Reminds me so much of, like, Final Fantasy VIII on the train. I have some healing items, so I might as well use them. Counter stance. 
Bang. Let's try this. They have gun blades or something. Have no MP. Do a Delta Shield. That's kind of nice. Delta Shield. Delta Shield. Oh. I would consider Candy Marsh a League of Legends slash variety streamer. <laughs> How's that? I mean, I could just call you a variety streamer. That makes you feel better. Double check, he just does a special thing to buff. Then beat you silly, you're supposed to run. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, it's one of those. Just like, don't mess with them. Let's try this. Punch is an emulator from Fardware. This is an emulated game because this game is incredibly expensive. Um, so I emulated it. It's on uh, Dolphin, the Wii emulator. Wii slash GameCube emulator. <laughs> I always have a problem with League. Yeah, I mean, it's the game itself is fine. It's just the community that's mostly toxic. And so as long as you're a good person that's playing League, it's all good. Toxic can't be me, no. No, never. <laughs> candy is a league streamer in a league of her own, exactly. It's the Candy League. What? They heal themselves? Music shift. Random enemies aren't allowed to heal. Candy's rank is carrot. Carrot rank. Carrot tier. The music shifts I hear, Ralph. <laughs> I'm in danger. Yeah, pretty much. It's the candy colt and you're a hostage. I'm a willing hostage. <laughs> Carrot tier is the only one that matters, yep. Electris. That hurt. Back off. Back off. You can train. We're good. Ugh. Ow. <laughs> Oh, it's your hanging plunge. Gotta go tend it to brood. Catch the rest of the pod. Bye, all. Keep your eyes peeled for the classic arcade cabinets. We'll do. <laughs> Have a good day, Green Lantern fan. Oh, is that the poison healing one? Oh, mess. They're doing counter stance. It was a lot harder when I don't have Dracula in my party. Really? Are they just going to heal themselves infinitely?
Alrighty, have a good nap, Candy Marsh. Thank you so much for the raid and for the subs. Chingu, yeah. Have a good rest. We'll see you again soon, I'm sure. Oh, thank you, thank you. Any more to come, I'm sure. Almost got him, yeah. <laughs> thank you, Kitty. Okay, I have lightning now. Focus. Oh, they're both countering. burst get wrecked there we go Sacri god damn it well, at least it's just one now That Galcian dude totally would have caught up by now. Yeah, good thing. Enjoying the view, yeah. <laughs> yes. Look, well, there's like whistling in the track. Well, that's definitely not a good, good color to use. Too bad. Doesn't have good attack. Oh no! It's fine. Be sure. Let's use Harry Box. See if you can counter this attack. Nice, he's dead. That's good. That was a close one. It sure was. We better level up after all that. Yeah, Candy Marsh gifted for you, Muric. She gave it a bunch of gift subs. And she rated. <laughs> I'm so glad you're safe, Fina. We were worried about you. Ten magic droplets can finally restore magic, yep. 
Nice, Aika. How did you? Why? How do you think? We're here to save you. You mean you did all this just for me? Aw, Athena, we're friends. You weren't going to let them take you from us. Thank you both so much. Honestly, I, I was so scared. I was all alone. I was afraid they were going to hurt me. Oh, thank you. I'm so grateful. Everything is okay now, Fina. Now, let's get out of here. <laughs> I can't allow that. What? He found us in this train car straight ahead of him. I am Galsian, Lord of the Imperial Armada. You have caused us a great deal of trouble, boy. What is your name? I'm Vice of the Blue Rogues. I just thought you were the guy that cleaned the rail cars. Ah, so you are the one who made a fool out of Alfonso. That girl is worth nothing to you air pilots. Hand her over to me. I guarantee that your lives, as well as that of the girl, will be spared. Is it a deal? Sounds fair. Never. I don't know what you want with her. But your Valois, whatever it is, it can't be good. Do you honestly think that after attacking the Valois Armada, you'll be able to fly the skies freely? We're air pirates. We don't need your permission for anything. If we see something we want, we take it. That's very disappointing. I'm afraid you will leave me no choice. I must destroy you. The little Jack. Oh. Nice. That's great. Yay! I love it. Classic. Chop the car right in half. Hey. Good thing they didn't miss by like three feet. Drachma never misses. You were late, Vice. We decided to come get you from the looks of it. We were just in time. Vina, are you all right? Thank you so much. Yes, thank you very much. I am very grateful that you've gone through so much trouble to rescue me. <laughs> Relax, Vina. We're okay right now. Save the mushy stuff for later. He is right. We can all be thankful after we've gotten out of Balawa. Captain, the emergency. They're closing the gates. Use the boost to get through. If the gate closes, we're all dead. Oh my god, and the cousin catnip ray raids back to back. Welcome on in, everybody. We are playing Skies of Arcadia Legends. Thank you so much for the raid, I appreciate it. Everyone check out Cousin Catnip. They are a fantastic streamer. They also are a game developer and ROM hack maker. You can see them play lots of ROM hacks and randomizers and random games on the channel. They're doing Summer of DK. Summer of DK and Banjo. This game I always wanted to play but never got to. Yeah, it's pretty good. Also, uh, Cousin Catnip has a podcast coming soon about uh, ROM hacking, so go over there and check him out. It's really, uh, really fun streamer. Doing some Bomberman 64 and Mega Man Randomizer. Yeah, I was watching that. I was there for most of it. I love Bomberman 64. It's so much fun. Such great music. The X3 Randomizer was pretty cool, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, thank you so much for coming over, and thank you for rating. I appreciate it. Um... We're doing Skies of Arcadia Legends, which is a cult classic JRPG for the GameCube. Our Man 64 is a good blast from the past. Let's see what you did there. Emphasis on the blast. 
We played a bit of that in Community Shuffler. Always a good time. Yeah, Plunge, I do mostly retro stuff and some other modern things as well. So, uh, yeah, thanks for coming on over. We just hit 500 follows, so we're doing a, uh, a uh, edutainment, 12-hour edutainment stream with all the classic edutainment games from the late 80s and early 90s on DOS and Windows, early Windows platforms. My mix stand is totally falling. We tighten the screw here. <laughs> <laughs> like that's really loose but yeah we actually have the the current list right now open to more suggestions but this is the current list of games that we've got going for that big old edutainment marathon yeah let's get back to skies of arcadia This game is very Star Wars. Star Wars, but it's Sky Pirates. We're under attack! Valawan ships dead ahead! They're blocking the entrance! Oh yeah, time for more ship fights. Hell yeah. We've got to act fast. We need to take out the blockade. Looks like I'm going to be able to test out the harpoon cannon earlier than I thought. All hands to battle stations! Jackman has joined the party. Again. I love that. Got a warning about you air pirates from Coliseum Guards. You're not getting through here. All right, I need to take a short break, actually. We'll be right back, everybody. BRB. Yeah, the ship fights are great. Be back in like three minutes. Just gotta take a quick little break. BRB. <laughs> 